Welcome everybody. Today I want to do a video on focusing on the Ventrac weight transfer system and using it with the blade plowing snow. I myself always thought the weight transfer system was for slope mowing, hillside, stability traction, that thing, but apparently I was wrong. I did a video last year on the 4500 with the 72 inch blade pushing snow and I had a comment in the comment section below from Dino Thinker that was telling me about using the weight transfer system and the benefits of it. Um, about a month ago we had some smaller snows but I got to play around with it and had some larger piles like you see behind me here and I got to use the weight transfer system in zero and number two and see the advantages of it and I figured it was worth doing a video to share with everybody. Uh, as he stated number two seemed to be the sweet spot and I'm going to agree with that. Number two seems to be about perfect while using it. There's a lot of other advantages to using the weight transfer system while plowing and I'm going to go ahead and share them. Now to adjust the weight transfer when you're plowing is very easy. You just lift the attachment, um, raise it to the highest position, and then you just select your weight transfer one through four. Like I stated, number two seems to be a really good spot. Some of the advantages of using the weight transfer system is the first snowfalls we get, uh, especially with me having a gravel driveway, sometimes while plowing snow, the base material, the stone will be soft and the skid shoes will every now and then occasionally want to dig down into the into the gravel. I've noticed by using it in weight transfer two, it lifts up on the blade and the weight just enough. You don't seem to get that digging action that you would in zero. Uh, just normal plowing, you know, even with the blade straight, it seems to give you uh, better traction for that. Like I stated, pushing these larger piles back has seemed better. But even using the power angle all the way in the left or right position, uh, the video will show in zero, if you're pushing larger piles of snow, you tend to have to steer into it sometimes. It wants to push the tractor over if the, you know, base coat's slick. Uh, this last snow we had, we had a good base under there where it was slick. I got to put it number two, and you could see the tractor steered straight, and you didn't seem to have more stability and weight on the front to give you better control. Now... It was really extremely cold and I had a hood up so I couldn't mount the camera to me. So I ended up mounting the camera up above on the roll bar. I apologize. Some of the video footage you're going to see, it's got my head in the way. But it's still clear enough that you can see the advantages of the weight transfer system. I'd like to thank Dino Thinker for his comment. Uh, I strongly recommend any of you guys that have any uh, tricks or tips to go ahead and put comments in the comments below. It helps other people that are watching these videos. They can read and learn. Like I said, I'd like to thank him for his comment, and I thought it really deserved a video because I was so impressed with how it worked. As always, guys, thanks for watching.